And we now go to an art gallery in Loyola Heights, Quezon City. Pia Bonalos is there and she will tell us more about their art exhibit entitled Mist in the Realm of Subconscious Mind. Hi Pia, good morning. Claire, women take center stage in this current exhibit here in Gallery Artists. And with me are the artists themselves who interpreted women in different ways, Miss Lydia Velasco and Camille De La Rosa, to tell us more about their works. Good morning, Puma. Yeah, good morning, too. Hi, good morning, Camille. Hi, good morning. Let's start with you, Miss Lydia. Yeah, you have yeah. always painted, um, depicted women in your paintings. Yeah, yeah. What is it about women that really um, na nag-inspire po sa inyo na sila po ang lagi ninyong pinipin? Actually, women is ano, masyadong um, sa kanila na lahat yung um, very strong personality ang woman kasi eh. Anyway, uh, nasa sa kanila na lahat yung, yung paano nila alagaan ang family. At the same time, be a good mother and a good has uh, wife. And 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 uh, na the bag bag tatrabaho pa sila yung ganon. So for this show, parang inilabas namin yung yung what is a woman, ba? Yung abi ma fantasy about ourselves and uh, what is uh, inside our koan. Yung... Dati po, ang mga paintings of women are women doing everyday things. Yes, yes, yes. More of like that. Um, how different naman po are your works for this particular exhibit? Actually, the gallery artists approached us to have a show that uh, different from the usual, usual uh, painting we have. So, Camille and me, nag-meeting about, uh, ano ba Camille ang ating magagawa about uh, other side of, as di ba sabi nga kaya ayun nag fantasy kami about something about kung mga ano so Camille and me merong mga fantasy kasi I'm not young na eh, di ba kaya kaya kumuha na lang ako from the books and from the yung mga idol ko mga paintings so from there binigyan ko sila ng ano ng different approach Yes, and one of those works is this one. Dito po, para they could see it, is parang um, from the Mona Lisa. This one has very religious undertones. Can you tell me po about this work? Actually, Mother of Perpetual Health is uh, my, my koan, parang guidance ba? Parang doon ako lagi nag, nag, uh, sasabi what is uh, my problem <laughs> yeah. and what is my hinihingi. And then, favorite ko rin si Mona Lisa. So, pinag, pinagsama ko yung si Mona Lisa and ba't hindi ko gawin si... Uh, Mother Perpetual Health si Mona Lisa since na idol ko sila pareho. Wow, and then that is captured here in this painting. You could still see the very mysterious smile of Mona, Liz Mona Lisa but yet ayun na, nakikita ko na rin yung inspiration when you put it in that context na Mother of Perpetual Health pala siya yeah, yeah, yeah. with the Bible and the rosary right there. The rosary is, if you notice, it's a, a sort of parang dice. Parang, it's a kwan kasi, parang saint or, or uh, this is the scene of the people, di ba? Yung ganon. So it's not siyang ganong ano na para yeah, is a yeah. sinner yeah, or a yeah, saint. Yeah, yeah. Wow, thank you very much, Miss Lydia. And then for you naman, Camille, you also, it's a big departure from your usual works. Ano ba usually yung mga ginagawa mong paintings beforehand? Uh, yung mga ginagawa ko dati, yung unang art, yung nag-start ako, mga gardens, mga traditional, tapos hindi ako nag-jump, naging surrealism, naging parang dark. From bones, gardens, parang napatayo to something as soft as your ano, mga paintings right here. Can you, ano, bakit, para sa'yo, ano ba ang babae? Bakit parang medyo nature yung theme nung ginawa mo? Uh, dito sa mga paintings ko, makita nyo, puro earth goddess. Kasi yung babae, para, para siyang nature din, kaya niyang mag-reproduce. Tsaka, pwede siyang maging productive, tsaka destructive. Parang nature, pwede siyang, ano, yung mga bagyo, yung mga ganyan. <laughs> Tapos yung, ito, makita yung mga, an, may mga animals, insects, kasi may hindi ka kasi animals, insects. Kaya, incorporate ko rin sa paintings ko. You didn't totally naman depart from your usual, kasi yun nga, parang yung old, yung works mo before this exhibit, ganun nakita ko eh, parang meron yung mga insects, may mga ano, and then, you incorporated it. Pero this one, parang, mas may pagka-soft, parang ganun yung dating. Can you tell me about this one right here? Sino ba tong goddess na nandito sa taas? Si Talasa. Si goddess. Ah. Goddess of the sea. Okay, and then, this is her. Ano naman yung pinaka, um, tinatry mong ma-capture dito? Kasi parang, 
Her face is so soft, yet her stance so powerful. Parang ganun yung nakukuha ko. Ayun, parang wala din sa ni Tita Lydia na yung mga babae, strong. Pero pag ano, pero pag nagalit sila, grabe, iba, ibang klase. <laughs> And it could really clearly be seen ka dito sa... Uh, Beautiful sila. Yes, exactly. Sobrang ganda niya. Na mga kalalakihan o kung ano. <laughs> Which is part of, of course, the charm of women and the strength. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Camille. For those of you who still want to, to see all the artworks here at Gallery Artists for this particular exhibit, it is still ongoing until the 17th of August. Only 10 more days to catch it. So do come here to Gallery Artists here in Saverville Avenue in Katipunan. Claire, Amelyn? Thanks, Pia.